generally, when we get the chance, we'll try and uh, bring the boys down to Tukuji Beach for a beach recovery. Um, so normally it's just a really good chance to have a little bit of uh, a subject of chat with the boys, um, you know, see how they're feeling. Normally after a hard session, if we've got the day off the next day, we try to do a beach recovery day, just because obviously you want to get all the boys in. A lot of the boys are sore and fatigued, so just come down and get in the water, and it's good for your muscles as well. Yeah, obviously there's so many different forms of recovery. I think that it's important that we as staff look at the mental side of the players, um, the timing and the duration of, of the sessions during the week, the, the distance between games, and um, you know we then formulate different ways in which we can um, give them the best opportunity to perform at the next opportunity. So um, as we see today, it's a good chance to get down to the beach, um, to get out of the training environment and see a different scenario, a different environment for, for, for the players to be able to relax and um, everyone enjoys coming to the beach so hopefully they'll come back in a couple of days time with uh, some um, refreshed bodies. In my opinion I feel like salt water does wonders but some of the boys don't agree with me they think it's just a myth but I, I, I believe in it. Normally when we come down to the beach here it's just a combination of a bit of walking, stretching, getting them in the water, getting some cold water immersion and also I just think it allows a really good opportunity for the guys to have a bit of a physical and a, and a cognitive reset as well. Yeah.